Hi, welcome to BG Vocals. My name is Billy Gallner. I am a singer and voice teacher based in Vancouver, Canada. If you're interested in learning more about me or to signing up for lessons, check out my website, bgvocals.com. Today, we are going to be reacting to a video that I have been asked to react to for a very, very, very long time. And I'm finally doing it. A huge thank you to my friend DJ Temple at Temple Academy of Music, who helped me figure out how to make this reaction video so that I didn't have to go through all of the growing pains of figuring out how to make one. So thank you to DJ. Let's get started. Very gracious with his bows at the beginning. It's always a good sign. It means you know you're going to be good. Dramatic looks. So he's starting in a very beautiful, light, lyric, mixy place. It sounds really beautiful, free and easy. And uh, let's keep going. Goes into chest voice on the bottom, rolls right back up into head register. Beautiful command of the registration, rolling easily from chest to head. Then that next note that just came through, so that's a really strong supported head register on the top. Uh, so he's gone from chest on the bottom, duh, where he's going from chest register, and then he's up on the, that big, beautiful, strong head register on the top. Some people call that reinforced falsetto. It's all really the same thing. Lots of people will argue about the terms, but uh, it's a really, really beautiful sound. Lots of command of his instrument. Let's keep going. <laughs> Now he's in a strong, bright chest mix. It's nice and forward. Backing off, still in a, in a chest mix. Keep his face in speech. Now this sound, this is a strong mixy sound, so you can hear that he's not really in like a a pure head register on the top, and it's not necessarily like full chest register either. It's kind of somewhere in between. We would call this mix. He's got a really amazing command of his instrument. In addition to that, I think that it's important to point out that he's an amazing performer. He has command of this stage. Sometimes people will have musicianship and an excellent voice, but they don't necessarily have the performance skills, and he really does have both, which is truly remarkable. But let's keep going. Gorgeously rolling between registers. Feeling it, I love it. And then back to the strong head register, wow. So that's just pure head register up on the top. Some you could argue that it's whistle register. Whistle register is just head register up very high. Uh, sometimes people will argue about the semantics of whether or not whistle register and head register are the same thing. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think about that. But the, the truth is that it's just the vocal fold stretching very, very, very thin. Uh, he has a beautiful command of his instrument going from chest register all the way up into head all the way on the top. 
People use different words for chest register and head register. Some people use thick folds, thin folds, M1, N2. Uh, there's a million different ways that people go about describing these sounds. I use the terms chest register and head register and mix register because those are generally the most commonly understood amongst voice teachers, singers, and uh, the professional field and the medical field. But uh, if you, whatever words you used, you can just hopefully we can translate. Uh, so it's just a gorgeous command of his instrument going all the way from the bottom to the top. There, you haven't heard very much constriction coming in or anything that's interfering with his sound. It's just a beautiful command of his instrument. One other thing before we get back to him singing is I'm noticing that he is really good at holding back. A lot of times when a singer has this much command of their voice, they have a tendency to over sing or think, oh, I've got to show off, show off, show off, riff, high note, strong the whole time. And what he's doing is he's going soft, light, gentle, bang, soft, light, gentle, bang. And what ends up happening is you get this beautiful contrast between amazing blow you away vocals and artistic tender moments. And it's that combination, it's that, that back and forth, that contrast that is so important. Otherwise, the impressive high notes just become impressive high notes. And then they're no longer impressive if you've heard six minutes of them back to back to back. So, so this is a, not only a beautiful performance, but also a really well-written piece and really strong artistic choices. Let's keep going. Je vis pour je yeah, exactly what I was just talking about. He's now in a light, very delicate place, very light and mixy. Now he's back to this strong chest mix, contrasting it in that very light, mixy place. And then it goes down super low. Now the first time he did this phrase, he rolled into head, and now he's in chest mix, just giving her on the top. Gorgeous. Yeah. Rolls up into head register again on the top there. And that contrast is just part of what makes it so impressive. Definitely deserved. My goodness, what a voice! This is a this is a really remarkable performance, and uh, he deserves that standing ovation. He deserves all of the viral success that he's had. It's a pretty remarkable instrument. Fan fascinated as a fan to sort of see how his voice will continue to grow over the years. This is quite an Olympic achievement of the throat. It's a uh, it will be very fascinating to see how he continues on with his singing career. Anyways, let me know in the comments below what you would like me to react to next. My name is Billy Gallner, and uh, please click the subscribe button, give this a thumbs up, and uh, I wish you all the best. If you are interested in taking a voice lesson with me, check out my website, bgvocals.com, and uh, I look forward to chatting with you soon. Peace.